Hey guys, Sam from Revit Auto here. On today's episode of Fix It Friday, we're going to be putting a new battery into this retired police interceptor. It's a Ford Crown Victoria. So what you're going to want to do first, is you're going to want to loosen up the terminals. So just take an 8mm socket. We get a wrench, but the socket's faster. So now that they're loose, we're gonna just wiggle them and pop them off like that. And what you don't wanna do next is there's a battery hold down right over here. Same size, just put your socket on it and then just start cranking on it. Maybe a bit tight at first, but it'll come out. So you just pop that out like this. And then once you have that out, pick up the battery sometimes they're a bit tight but just gotta send it It'd be nicer if there's a handle on it but don't always get that just like that we have the old one out all right so now what we're going to want to do is before putting it in just pop this off Make sure that battery's centered properly. Just put your terminals down all the way on them. Now you're just gonna take your ratchet, just tighten them back up. And once they're on, just give them a little wiggle, make sure they don't have any play in them. And then next up is you're gonna wanna take your battery hold down and put it back in. So it can be a bit hard to see sometimes, but there's a hole right there. And you just put it down and it'll thread right in. Once you have the hole down threaded in, just finish it off with the ratchet. And then once you have it hand tight, or not hand tight, but tight enough, you're gonna wanna just take it out. As you see, securing the battery pretty well. And now you're just gonna go fire up the car. Car starts right up. So that's how you replace a battery on a Crown Vic. That's it. See you guys next time.